debating. It is a comprehensive exercise that builds character, thinking, language, and mutual respect. My name is Kairi Jamaluddin, and I believe the culture of debate is the way forward. I think debating has not only introduced me to good friends, debating has also changed the way I view the world, the way I construct my sentences. Debating actually helped me also see from different perspectives and help my ideas develop and grow as well. Let us talk about what happens in a tournament. Just as the military draw out offence strategies, debaters read and produce fact files, lots of them. Thick files covering topics that range from international politics, societal dilemmas, to education policies and medicinal morality. You are debating not only in the room, but you are debating 24-7. It means that it's a lifestyle de change and a demand there, that you have to be constantly reading articles, you have to be constantly on CNN figuring out what, what is the new uh, update in the world, to be able to be relevant in the debating scene. Reading is just one part of the equation. In tournaments such as nationals, they only have 15 minutes to prepare for a debate. Debaters are who they are because of the rigorous training they put themselves through. It has the potential to create a pool of highly talented individuals. And we build on uh, fact sheets that help us when we go through these debates and work on, uh, in terms of sparring with our team members or other other people, other people who come and visit our clubs, we always, we always uh, get more experience from them and how this helps us better our experience with debating and further uh, enhance our skills in terms of winning debates. I believe that debating creates critical thinkers, confident advocates and more importantly, creates tolerance amidst diversities. It has the potential to create individuals with a wider perspective on issues and the strength of mind to react in a mature manner to differences of opinion. Debating has the potential to create capable and intelligent young leaders and this is what we need today. There's a certain stereotype that people have to local graduates that they are unable to compete with foreign graduates. However, being in the debate has enabled me to gain a level of confidence that's able that's enabled me to compete with other students. Hence, I believe that when I in a working environment, people will no longer be able to determine whether you're a foreign or a local graduate because of the level of um, competitiveness that you gain from the group. toughest of situations and the most desperate of situations in the workplace. Uh, those kinds of values in terms of ideas and thinking out of the box and always pushing the, the boundaries of what is acceptable and limitations, um, those are all things that debates you know, have, have taught me that, that, could trans that have translated into the workplace as well. I would like to take a moment here to commend the achievements of the Malaysian debating community. Two Malaysian universities currently rank in the top 30 debating universities in the world. We just won the Asian-British Parliamentary Debating Championship. We have ranked in the top teams at the World Universities Debating Championship for two years in a row. And even at the high school level, Malaysians have become champions of the Asian World Schools Championships for two years in a row and are ranked top five in the world. I would like to encourage the youth of Malaysia to be part of this culture. So go on, get debating.